Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about double integrals. So now I will show you how to answer. We don't have the formula to do this integration. So in this situation, we need to change dx dy into dy dx. To do about this one, we need to change the bounds to. So we need to wrap about this region. So we have the S. So S is greater than Y to the power of 1 over 3 and smaller than number 2. So the wrap should be like this. So this one does it about s equals to y to the power of 1 over 3 and this is about s equals to number 2. About y from 0 to 8. So here is about number 8. Here is about number 0. So the region we need to concentrate, that's about this one. So because we change into dy dx, so we need to create the new bounds of this one. So about dy, that is about this one in here. So we have s equals to y to the power of 1 over 3. So we put the power 3 for the both sides and you got about s to the power of 3 equals to y. So we see that y is smaller than s to the power of 3 and this line in here, that's about y equals to number 0. So the bounds of dy, that should be about from 0 to s to the power of 3. About the S, that is about this one. We see that we start from 0 and we stop at number 2. So the bounds of the S is about from 0 and number 2. And now we put the function going here. Now we need to calculate about this one. The integration of dy, we have y. So we can put the bounds from 0 to s to the power of 3 dx. So I will put this one going here, number 0 going here. So we have s to the power of 3 minus 0. And we have e to the power of 2s to the power of 4 ds. This one, we have the integration from 0 to number 2. And we have this one in here. Now, we can use about integration by substitution. So, I will put about u equals to 2s to the power of 4. Later that we do first derivative for the both side and you got about the u equals to 2 first derivative of s to the power of 4 we have 4s to the power of 3 ds because we don't have number 8 so we need to divide both sides by number 8. Now we need to change the new bounds in here. When s equals to number 0, that's it from here. So we put number 0 on here to find the value of u and we have u equals to number 0 
when x equals to number 2. So we put number 2 going here. And you got about u equals to 32. And we have the interaction from 0 to 32. This one we change by u. S to the power of 3 dx, we change by the u over number 8. And now we have the final answer. So I will put 32 going here, number 0 going here. And we got the final answer. e to the power of 0, we have number 1. And this is the final answer. Or we can write like this. This is the end. Thank you for watching.